Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Schneider's Golf. It is a beautiful Thursday evening here. We actually have snow in the mountains. We had an inch of snow on the golf course yesterday morning, but it's all melted off, and so we're ready to make another video. Now, I have been surprised by the amount of people that are interested in the equipment that we have on the golf course. The different machinery, the mowers, the aeration machinery, the sand trap stuff, all of the different equipment that we use on the golf course. So we're going to start a new series that's called Golf Course Equipment Showcase. And today we're going to be showcasing the Groundsmaster 4500D. Check it out. So for a lot of years, our family businesses have used what are called gang mowers, which are the real mowers that you pull behind a tractor. So those are kind of outdated. They're a lot of maintenance. They've worked really well for us, but it's time to upgrade our fleet. We're moving into rotary mowers, which give a much better, more consistent cut, and they're very productive. So they mow a lot of grass. One guy, you know, can go around trees, can get into tighter spaces. So all in all, just a great addition for our fleet here at Schneider's Bluff. Let's talk a little bit about this amazing piece of machinery that keeps our golf course looking nice. The first thing is these 30, I believe these are 31 inch decks. So that would be a 31 inch blade, as you can see. Got a mulching fin up on the top here. The 4500D has these little pod rollers on the front and then a big combing roller on the back. So this machine is great for laying down some heavy stripes. The 4500D has five decks. So there's one, two, three here. And then you have two decks tucked underneath the unit. As you can see here, there's one, two under there. Now, if you see a unit that's the 4700D, it has two additional mower decks that fold down on the back right here. So you get seven decks on the 4700D. So Toro says that the 4500D is capable of mowing at eight miles an hour, transporting at 13 miles an hour. So you can't drive any faster than eight miles an hour, which is still pretty fast when you're mowing grass. It's got a 55 horsepower motor. I believe it's turbocharged for you people that are into turbos. So let's pop this hood quick. We'll take a look at the little mini turbocharger in here. It's kind of cute. All right, so we have the motor open here. These are a Yanmar motor. You can see this little mini turbocharger here. It's a pretty powerful filling mower when you're on it. Four wheel drive, so it gets up and down, can go on hills, very stable, not at risk, a ton of risk for rolling, um, and four wheel drive, so it's got enough traction to get up steep stuff when it's wet, which can be an issue. All right, we'll move around to the operator's console quick, give you a little sneak peek. You have on these new mowers, two nice armrests. This is where the gas goes in, hydraulic fluid on the other side. You can see that there's a brake pedal and then just a hydrostatic forward and backwards pedal. And I like these new 4500Ds. They have this cool operator center that kind of gives you gas consumption. Really everything about the unit comes up on this little display and it makes it super nice for the operator to be able to see what's going on with the unit. How's the oil? How's the fluid level, just things that you need for diagnostics. So one of the biggest things about this unit in particular is just how comfortable it is to mow on. You have an armrest here, you have an armrest here. The pedal's very accessible. It's just a great unit. You can spend eight to 10 hours a day on this unit and it doesn't really wear you out. It's, it's a very comfortable mow. So let's start this thing up. I'll kind of go through the controls and how things work and then we'll mow some grass with it. We'll lay down some stripes. So to get this bad boy going, you just flip the key on. You have a throttle control here. You have a high and low range here. And then this is what raises and lowers the decks. So we'll go ahead and turn it on. If I want to throttle up, just push this. You can click it to go incrementally higher on the throttle. Or if I hold it down, it'll go all the way up to full RPM. But you can see that there. And I like it because it doesn't vibrate into the turtle mode. A lot of throttles tend to vibrate into turtle mode when you're mowing, which is annoying. You have to keep pushing it forward. So it's nice to have it where it's just, it's there, good to go. All right, when we're ready to start mowing, obviously we're gonna kick the throttle all the way up into the rabbit mode, so high throttle. And then we're going to move our mower into low speed. So that's the mow gear. And then we're gonna pop this up and that will turn the blades on. And then we'll raise and lower the decks with this control here.
another really cool thing about these rotary mowers is that we can go in between these trees without having to lift a mower or get off the tractor. You can just go right in between them, weave around, come back. Mows in between the trees really nice. All right, that's about the end of our tour. As you can see here, I just got done mowing this tee box. This is one pass, check it out. I mean, those are some solid lines for one pass. You can definitely tell that it is striped. And the light's not even that good. The sun's kind of going down. Very, very impressive cut with this unit. It's a ton of fun to mow with. One of my very favorite things about being on the golf course and working on the golf course is hopping on a mower and cutting some grass. And this is a fun unit to do it on. Really impressed with our 4500Ds. Thanks for being here. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something new about these awesome grass units. A lot of technology that goes into cutting grass. It's pretty cool. If there's a piece of machinery that you wanna see or that you're interested and we have it, let me know in the comments. We'll try and do some kind of showcase on it. Hope you're having a great day. Get out and play some golf and we will see you next time. Take care.